Hi, welcome to my channel. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. I just wanted to come with a video talking about interracial relationships, but here it says interracial marriages from the Bible. And I'll start. Many people are deceived. They say you can't have black and white marriages. They say interracial marriage is a sin. Wrong. Scripture has nothing to do, nothing to say about interracial marriages. What is what it does talk about is interfaith. Whether African American, I would just call it black, because not all black people are African American, Caucasian, or Native American. God doesn't care. He doesn't judge anyone by their skin tone, and neither should we. In an Old Testament, God didn't want his people marrying people of the other nations, not because of race, but because they would lead his people astray. They were pagans, idolaters, and they worshiped false gods. Look how Solomon was led astray. The only thing God tells Christians to stay away from is unbelievers. Because what does righteousness have in common with lawlessness? lawlessness? Do not intermarry with them. Do not give your daughters to their sons or take their daughters for their your sons for because they will turn your sons away from me to worship other gods. So be very diligent to love the Lord your Lord your God because if you ever turn back and cling to those who remain of those nations by intermarrying with them and associating one with another know for certain that the Lord your God will not continue to drive out these nations ahead of you the Israel, the Israel teens, I don't know, continue to live among Cassantes, the Hades, the, um, I don't know, <laughs> taking their daughters as wives for themselves, giving their own daughters to their sons, and serving their gods, the Israel teens kept on practicing evil in view of the Lord. Make a promise to me before the Lord, the God of heaven and earth. Do get don't get a wife for my son from the canopy girls who live around here. Therefore do not give your daughters to their sons, neither take their daughters for your sons, and never seek their peace or prosperity. You must not marry people of other nations, not race, nations. If you do, they will cause you to follow their gods. But Solomon fell in love with these women. He had 700 wives who were from royal families and 300 slave women who gave birth to his children. His wives caused him to turn away from God. Oh. I made them swear in the name of God that they would not let their children in to marry with the pagan people of the land. Wasn't this exactly what led King Solomon of Israel into sin? But even if he was led into sin by his by his foreign wives how could you even think of committing this sinful deed and acting un 
faithfully toward God by marrying foreign women. God does not want you to make the mistake of marrying a non-Christian. Do not be mismatched with not unbelievers. Can Christ agree with the devil? Can a believer share a, share life with an unbeliever? Of course not. Do not judge according to appearance, but judge with righteousness. Judge righteous judgment. I'm sorry about that. Therefore, a man shall leave his father and his mother and he and hold fast to his wife and they shall become one flesh and what that means is they become one as in they're not just separate but they're together but this has nothing to do with sex by the way charm is deceitful and beauty is vain but a woman who fears the lord is praised to be praised she brings him good, not harm, all the days of her life. Therefore is neither Jew nor Greek, there is neither slave nor free, there is no male and female, for you are all in one in, Christ, all one in Christ Jesus. God does not show favoritism, for God shows no penalty. I may have butchered them. From one man he made all nations that they should inhabit the whole earth, and he marked out their appointed times in history and the boundaries of lands. Well, that's it for this video. Like if you liked it, thumbs it up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to be notified by all the new videos I upload. Okay, bye!